Generosity generates possibilities that take on many forms and faces. World-class facilities that attract the best teachers and provide welcoming and engaging spaces for students to thrive. Pertinent resources and services combined under one roof and students on scholarships succeeding simply because they are allowed to focus. These are hopes realized because someone bothered to care. It's very difficult to try to ascertain the reasons why people give. It's just born with you. You're born to see the joy in others. You'd rather see the joy in the twinkle in somebody's eye that's received something than what it means for you to receive something. When a community gives back, as much as the communities have to my family, the Carl Magalette family and Flying J and Maverick, the family needs to give back to the community. The second part of giving is the effect that your giving has on people. It's very exciting to see if you give a scholarship to someone, what it means to them and the impact that it has on their life. There are many advantages that these facilities offer to all student athletes uh, with our new training center, our new lifting center that we have here. Uh, top of the line, people that are here to help us if we ever have injuries. I feel like that gives us an edge. Uh, academically, I definitely feel like we have the best resources that any school can offer. Having received the Kane Scholarship has enabled me to pay for school. Being able to dedicate time and effort to studying the thing that, that I really, really love is a wonderful, wonderful opportunity. Well, we're actually going to have scene shops and costume shops, which will be purpose-built and which will allow us to build these fabulous sets and amazing costumes. Big effect in terms of the quality of training that we can give students and big effect in terms of the quality of productions that students and members of the community can come and see. So I have four daughters and they range in age from 20 years old to six. All of them have different disabilities. Two of them are autistic, profoundly deaf, and then anxiety and depression. Sometimes I've had to choose, like this semester, I'll do these two therapies for these two kids because I can't juggle all of it all the time and still work and everything that has to happen. And so the new beautiful building is gonna make it that it's all in one place and I don't have to pick. My utmost respect and appreciation to those that have contributed to bringing everything that we have here together. My college experience wouldn't be what it is right now without them, and so I appreciate everything that they've done. Uh, go Aggies. Because of Dan and Manon Russell, I, I, can, I can do things that I would never be able to do before. Thank you, deeply. I'm just so grateful. I'm really grateful. If you were here, I would give you a hug. <laughs> Utah State University's giving impacts consist of stories of promise and achievement, like pages in a book, that can be measured through every decade of its 128-year existence. They are accomplishments that span 15 university presidents, 15 chapters of giving history. Our current chapter, the Albrecht years, marks a particularly generative period of record-breaking giving and building. To raise money is a difficult, competitive, uh, almost impossible job in today's world. And Stan Albrecht is the best I've ever met at it. I would say to Stan and Joyce that uh, you've carried out your duties in a remarkable and positive and most gracious manner. I've said, Stan, many times, and I know you don't believe this, but I've said, Stan, you're the finest university president in America. That does not come from my lips. That comes from my heart. All the contact that I have had with the president, has, he is just a gracious individual, and he's very easy to talk to, very genuine. Um, I think that it's easy to give to an institution where you see that the dollars are being used in the best possible way. They're very, very comfortable in being responsible for every dollar that's contributed to Utah State. They put it to good use and they give an accounting for it. All the good being generated at Utah State University is a result of those who have given so much of their time and means. They are achievements impossible to count or contain because when you give hope a chance, possibility knows no boundary.
I've never seen anything like the thriftiness and the return on one's investment by making a charitable contribution to Utah State University.